Hello, it's Rachel. Today's video is for my Mixed Media Challenge group over on Facebook and the theme this week is Flourishes. I'm starting here with some Distress Ink on my craft sheet and I'm going to use the Wrinkle Free Distress Technique to pick up the ink onto my hot press watercolour paper. Next I'm going to add some stenciling to my piece, for this I've chosen a Tim Holtz mini stencil with a diamond or harlequin pattern and I'm using it with some wild honey distress ink applied with a piece of Ranger cut and dry foam. Now I'm going to add some stamping to my piece, for this I've chosen a background text stamp by Stamping Up and I'm stamping using Archival Ink in the colour Watering Can. For the focal images on my page I've chosen to use some flowers from a Paper Artsy stamp set, this is Jofi 32. I'm stamping them using VersaFine ink in Onyx Black before cutting them out and adhering them to my project using some Golden Matte Medium. To add colour to the flowers I've chosen to use some watercolours by Windsor & Newton and I'm applying these using a Prima water brush.
Here you can see that I've masked off the flowers and this is so that I can add some flourishes to my project. And for this I've chosen a flourish stamp by Crafty Individuals and I'm using Archiver Link in Manganese Blue. As a final touch on today's project, I'm using a white Posca paint pen to add some detail to the flower centres. That is everything for today. I hope you enjoyed watching. If you did, I appreciate it when you hit the like button or leave me a comment. If you are interested in playing along with the challenge, there is a link to my Facebook group in the video description. And there's also a link there to the full product list using today's video.